Monroe, Connecticut police say the Instagram posts were first reported to them in January. An unidentified account with, quote, nude and inappropriate photos of Monroe youths being used to shame, ridicule, and bully students. The targeted teenagers attended Jockey Hollow Middle School. Three young people now face charges, including possession of child pornography, risk of injury to a minor, and harassment. Monroe police wouldn't release the age or sex of any of the juveniles they arrested. The local paper, the Monroe Sun, says it's a mix of middle and high school students. An estimated 75% of teenagers have at least one active social media account. Dawn Tymon, mom of a teenager, says the charges in this case are troubling. And I don't think they think of the consequences long term. Something that should not be posted out or even get out in general and shouldn't be even taking pictures in, in the first place at all. Instagram says it is constantly developing tools to keep the site safe for teenage users. Parents have an important role to play discussing ground rules and monitoring activity. To see when is that teen ready and then even when they're on the platform, what is that experience going to be like and how can you set your teen up to have the most intentional, safe, positive experience while you're there? You know, you just post good things about people. You know, no negativity. Be nice, polite, have respect. Local school officials were not available for comment. Police say all the issues raised by this troubling crime are being addressed with programs in the schools. In Monroe, Connecticut, Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News. Police say that there were also racially insensitive material posted on the Instagram account controlled by the three students. They were charged as juveniles and released to their parents.